calves they're a lot brighter they're a lot more alert um, you know they're uh, a lot more active running around the calf pins and that sort of stuff uh, we just find that transitioning period you know we're not getting any setbacks we're having no real issues with score and uh, John Buckley is my name I'm farming here in Bantry in West Cork with my father Carney and we're an autumn and spring calving herd um, so I suppose one of the biggest challenges we have at the moment is um, transitioning from the cow's milk to milk replacer. We're trying to follow a Yone's control program here and we want to get on milk replacer as quickly as we can. But that's leading to a good few issues with uh, scour and whatnot. Um, and that was our reason for, for trying precision microbes uh, last year. So um, since we started on it, um, you know we're not having any major issues with scour uh, any calves that are getting a bit of a setback they're getting over quite quickly we can leave them on milk um, you know but they're still very active uh, running around the pins and you know still quite anxious yeah. to um, to drink and you know they've got a great color to their coat and that sort of stuff like you know so yeah they're going well so we um, every calf get 30 mils in their colostrum and then every morning it's uh, 30 mils in their milk as well and we're going to continue that for 30 days. Absolutely, yeah, we've got on really well with it. Um, we're seeing a huge improvement in the vigour of the beef calves in particular. They can be quite challenging to get them to drink at a young age, um, but since we introduced the precision microbes, we're seeing, um, you know, within 24 hours, the majority of these calves are away and drinking on their own, which is great.